You already know it's your boy Joe back again about to teach you about some web development teach you exactly what do you need to become a web developer right so here are the couple of requirements man there's the basics this all you really need operating system operating system is just it means what type of computer you have so pretty much you could actually make uh, any website or you know just play around with things with any system you could do a Mac, Windows, Linux. I actually use a Mac and it's easier. It's actually easier for me to, you know, do web development in a Mac because of the way how the terminal is and I don't know. It feels like so much easier for me. Okay, so you need a text editor. A text editor is pretty much it's like Microsoft Word. So for you to be able to type your, you know, your code, you need something to basically write it with because using anything like a notepad or, you know, the regular text editor from, you know, that comes with Mac is a nightmare. You need something that's going to have actually the highlights of the code and it tells you what's a HTML tag, what's a HTML params, whatever it is, but you actually need a text editor, right? So you got stuff like Atom, Sublime, Visual Studio, Code, WebStorm. Personally, I use Atom. It's so much easier for me to have it and you know it has a lot of packages that you know become very helpful as you know as you get to learn more and more about uh, web development, there's a lot of stuff that you don't want to keep doing constantly. So with packages, it actually makes it easier for you so you don't have to keep repeating the same thing that you've done before. Or sometimes you want to learn a new language and your editor actually knows about that language. So like, let's say if I wanted to write something in React, what I will do is I will download a package from Adam that is called React Language. So now I could actually, uh, the editor could actually give me some highlights on, you know, on React. So it's pretty simple. All right. You got to make sure that you're going to give yourself time to learn. This is not something you're going to learn from one day to another. This is something that you have to put in some time and say, hey, do I want to be ready in a year from now? Okay, so maybe I just do two hours a day. Now, if you want to be ready six months from now, you got to put in four hours a day. Now, if you really want to go all out and you want to learn all the basics and everything that you need to be able to find a job right away, pretty much you got to do eight hours. It's that simple. There's no if and buts about it. You just have to put in the time and then from there, you're going to have all the basics and trust me, there's plenty of jobs for you out there. Also, you cannot give up. You got to understand, you cannot give up, man. Trust me, you're going to hit some roadblocks and you're going to bump into stuff that you don't know or even certain things that you want to do that you might not even see in this tutorial but you can't give up whatever idea you might have you want to create the next facebook whatever or the next google or whatever idea you might have you might want to sell t-shirts online and you want to make your own website well there's gonna be roadblocks so you can't give up because somewhere in the internet Somebody already did that for you. They already went through that mistake that you did or wherever you stuck. So all you have to do is Google. You put in the question that you want to find out. Like, hey, how do you change the color of a background? Or how do I uh, arrange a list? Or how do I add images? Whatever it is that you want to do, just go on Google and put the question. Say, hey. How do I change the CSS or whatever it is? You know what I mean? So Google is your friend. Make sure that you constantly searching on Google or Stack Overflow or even Quora. Just ask other people or if anything, just go ahead and just leave a comment here and I'll make sure that I'll, you know, I'll write down the answer for you. I'll show you where to go or I'll give you a little tip. You know, sometimes it's not good to get the answer. It's better to just find out on your own self, like, you know, how to do it. But, you know, if you're stuck for a day or two, forget about that. Just ask somebody for the answer. After you get the answer, you will understand what the hell is going on.
But yeah, man, you already know it's your boy Joe. Make sure you subscribe. We about to do really big this year, 2016, 2017, man. We're gonna do it really big this year. Make sure you subscribe, man. Trust me and click the notification so you could actually get you know a little notification on the top or on your phone that says, Hey, new video just came up. You already know it's your boy Joe. Bow.